For what purpose does a gentleman from Florida seek recognition? Speaker, you unanimous consent to address the House for one minute. Without objection, the gentleman is recognized for one minute. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise to bring attention to the brave action of the pro-democracy leaders in Cuba and the brutal repression that they face as a result of their demands for freedom. For example, in the last few weeks, the San Isidro movement has stepped up its calls for freedom and the release of all political prisoners. Their protests include such dangerous activities as poetry readings and sit-ins. And for that, these young rappers, artists, and writers have faced arbitrary arrests, harassments, and abuse. Some remain in prison, which is why many activists have begun a hunger strike in protest. But despite the brutal repression in Cuba, the pro-democracy movement, movement is growing. Mothers, scientists, and so many others have joined its calls for freedom and the release of political prisoners, Mr. Speaker. I commend President Trump and his administration for their solidarity with the Cuban people in imposing serious sanctions against the Cuban dictatorship. We must all stand with the brave pro-democracy activists in Cuba who are risking their lives at this very moment and join them in their pleas for freedom and the immediate unconditional release of all political prisoners. I yield back, Mr. Speaker. The gentleman yields back.